Hello, this is Martin Brossman, and I want to talk about the new Google custom URLs. Basically, you need to wait until you receive an invitation like this, and I'm going to post at the bottom of this video a link to the information about it so you can learn more if you're interested. And then when you get here, it gives you an option, and you click Get URL. So I'm actually on my personal page here, personal profile page, and I've gotten this invitation to connect right here. Do you see that? So I'm going to go ahead and click on it. And then it says that I can change my original link to my Google Plus profile page, which is really hard to tell people. Would you please go to plus.google.com forward slash 1033 blah, blah, blah. In the past, what I had done is I bought a URL called Brossman on GP.com, which you can go see, that points to this to make it easier for people using your URL forwarding that I explained in my class. Then here's what I can change it to. It's going to give you some options. So based on how common your name is, you choose it. Uh, I'm fortunate that it's available just directly. So then if you want to read the terms of service, you can click that and then click I agree. And after you do that, you'll click change URL. Now it goes, hey, think twice. Are you sure this is what you want? Which I do. I think I'm going to keep my uh, name. And now it gives me a little congratulations. Martin Brossman, you've claimed the following URL. So let me demonstrate this. Very cool to have. So if I go to google.com, it says plus Martin Brossman. And it goes there. So it went to the, it goes to the default setting is the post when you first get it. And this completes this video. Look forward to hearing your comments below. This is Martin Brossman and have a great day.